Welcome, I'm Julie Pastrick with the Greater Flagstaff Chamber of Commerce, and with me is... I'm Kelly Elliott, the CEO and Executive Director of Big Brothers Big Sisters of Flagstaff. Kelly, I am so happy to be sitting here with you, <laughs> and I want to so congratulate much. you on your Athena nomination. You are a remarkable person who has been at Big Brothers Big Sisters for 15 years, and you have made such a huge difference. What is it that keeps you going and passionate about your mission? Thank you, Julie. Um, I'm so honored to be here, by the way. I, um, you know, I went into social work um, with the ideal that I wanted to help change lives, and I was lucky enough to um, start my career at Big Brothers Big Sisters through um, the NAU social work department. I was getting my Great. degree there, mm -hmm. and I got to be an intern under Kay McKay, who founded Big Sisters. Who founded Big Sisters. And uh, I think she was an Athena winner, too. Yes. Um, but uh, she was really like a big sister to me and a mentor to me and really inspired me in my love of working with children. It's something I didn't know that I wanted to do until I was there. And uh, I just love my job and I love my team and the opportunities that I get to experience over these years. Um, it's been very fulfilling. So. I love that. That's a beautiful word. It, it, and and believe me, the bigs and the littles love you too. And so do all of the, the people that are taking time out to help the lives of the younger kids. <laughs> um, well, I know from your application that it, through COVID-19, you've really pivoted and you've really had to change it up. Talk a little bit about how that felt. And I know that we're especially uh, excited about continuing bigs and littles with in the virtual realm. Right. Yeah, so a year ago, almost now, um, we went into lockdown and um, basically um, went into survival mode for our bigs and littles and their families. We just immediately started to try to figure out how we could help care for their basic needs at that point. And then it moved into, um, we need to make sure that they keep connected. Exactly. Because everyone was separated from each other and stuck at home and so was that easy to figure out it it wasn't no it um, isn't because i think our team also had to learn how to work from home mm -hmm. um and new ways to communicate in that way um but a lot of our families didn't have technology that would they would need to have a virtual match oh my gosh um, so we started applying for emergency grant funding um, that was COVID related so that we could purchase tablets and Wi-Fi hotspots and there you for, were. for our families. Yeah. And something I know about your success is that you had so many littles paired that you needed to get a call out for littles. Yes. Is we're that, doing that right now. That's amazing. That is so successful. <laughs> I'm, I'm so, so, so proud of you for that because it really takes a lot to figure out what the next steps are and hope that everybody can understand kind of sort of how to come along with you. Some do right. and some don't. But by now, of course, we understand. But it wasn't easy at the start. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, you, you, your life of service to others is in a way that a lot of people don't see outcomes. Uh, when you look at bigs and you look at littles, uh, what are some of your most, uh, let's say maybe even through COVID-19, what are some of your more happy stories? Oh, gosh. I well, know there's, there's a million. There's so many. Um, I think our most recent ones have been, um, we've, uh, my team has been doing virtual match events twice a month. What does and that mean? So that instead of us meeting in person and putting on, you know, a craft or activity or a group mentoring program, um, we do it over Zoom. And um, they've done everything from they've had a local beekeeper come on and talk about harvesting his honey and how the bees um, live in the hive. And the kids join on the Zoom with their bigs and they can discuss it. Um, we've had we have worked with uh, a local bookshop to provide um, diversity and equity and inclusion literature for, for kids, and they can share it with their bigs. That's so um, neat. They've done hula hooping lessons. They've done. Isn't that amazing? That is, now you got to pat yourself on the back because that is <laughs> extremely creative. Well, I have to thank my team, really. They, yeah, yeah. they are um, extremely creative and very eager to make sure that these kids are not forgotten in a time when things are very crazy in their world. 
And we almost have to go, but what yeah. is a Love Bugs and Operation Elf? Elf. <laughs> Those are two new things we did this year because of COVID. Uh, normally we have a big holiday party um, at Little America and all the kids get a present and our board members love to organize that, but we couldn't do it this year. So they all dressed up as elves and they went and delivered um, gifts to the Little's houses That's safely. So cool. And um, then we did the same thing for Valentine's Day. We had people, it was a fundraising event. And, uh, Love bugs. We went and decorated their front door. Um, so I thought got, that was amazing. That took a lot of outreach. It was, That's so it neat. was a lot of work, but it was very, uh, very re rewarding and it helps us little by little keep the programs going. Well, yeah. thank you, Kelly Elliott, CEO and Executive Director of BBBS, Big Brothers, Big Sisters. What does this Athena nomination mean to you as, as we close? You know, because I am in a, a nonprofit that does mentoring, that's really what humbled me the most about the nomination because my whole life professionally and personally is around building these um, supportive relationships and mentoring others. And I'm here because Kay McKay mentored me. I love it. And That's uh, a big I connection. want to do that for other women. In, I love it. In, That's a huge yeah. connection. In front of you is a certificate uh, to present to you as you, as a nominee. We want you just to look at the camera and say, that's Kelly Elliott from mm -hmm. Big Brothers Big Sisters. Congratulations and thank, thank you, you for all you do. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. <laughs>